Hello viewers and appreciate you watching. Today Eric and I are headed out to pull a truck that's stuck on a sewer line. Uh, as you can see, uh, not sure. It feels like, I mean, I got the winch on the front of it. It actually feels hard. I believe so, Eric. It looks like you're standing up pretty good. Do you have the uh, bulldog hitch on there? Yes, sir, it's there. Okay. It's down there. Hey, just um, get right here on this side and uh, okay. you got a locking hitch on there? Yeah, turn around, you pull better from the back. What you want me to do now? You framed out or you don't know? Give me the bubble rope. Probably need a couple. I don't think we're gonna be able to get that. He's got a lock and hitch on there. Okay. That I hate to drop something over his ball, though. Well, yeah. Let me see if uh, let's see if I can get this wrap around there. Of course, you um, you got a key for this lock on your hitch. You didn't bring your J chains, did you? Uh, I didn't have mine off the truck, though, sir. Oh, that's got the big receiver in it. That's not gonna help me. You want me to take it off? No, it's not. That hitch up to pull it off? Mm -hmm. you, that ain't gonna help you. Yeah, that's. Hey, give me the red rope. Two shackles. And an oblong ring. Red rope. Hold on.
gonna work either. Uh, I'm gonna do what we always forget when we go out. I'm gonna take pictures. Any more shackles there? Yes, sir. I got these two right there, and then the big one right there. They're all the same way, they're all caked up. This last one right here too or no? Well yeah we gotta get that together over yeah, there. You get the hook to the machine. Oh, the skin stick, skin stick. hard right there you want him we'll to see get it. you I mean, we'll see if i got any traction once before we get loose cut right, loose we'll just pretty much get you up here and then i'll stop and let, let you see what you can do Just try to just tighten on it first for me. Just pull it off. Just pull yeah, it don't jerk try not to snatch him yet. You in a uh, reverse, Carson? Yes, sir. 
Can you cut your wheel or is it locked up? All right, try to back up. Hold up, Carson. Come back. All right, go, Carson. Hold up, hold up. You good on your side, Carson? Slow down. Hey, I'm gonna have him just ease you out. Yeah, just um, I tell you what, can you just steer it? Watch that tree. Oh, Carson, yeah, cut it. Lock it up, Carson. Yeah, that way. You got any traction there, Carson? Hold up. You barely missing this manhole. Back up, pull him this way just a touch. There. You want me to come back up there? Viewers, you need to start looking under your feet. Evan and I came across this little fellow this past weekend. Yeah, I want to slide the back end of him over just a little bit. Do I got enough to tow that way? Yeah. I need to back up more. Yeah, go that way. I just need you to pull the back end over just a little bit. Watch your front end on the other side on that manhole. All right.
Are you good on the trees on your side? Straighten up just a little bit. Right there. You still clear? <laughs> you clear over there? You good on my side. All right, cut it back to me. Cut it the other way, Carson. Come back here. Come on back. Go this way here. some of them uh, 11 and a 12 that had that DPF filter and they wouldn't I was putting money in left and right so I took the bed off of them because I couldn't get no money for them and we put the bed just on new chassis yeah that looks good I like that yeah they got it we got the wrap order for them like the rest of them yeah they got to come from Florida so yeah. Well, the guy, he's, he's always wrapped my trucks. He was um, a cousin of one of uh, my employees. And he started wrapping them, and he did a good job, and the wraps always held up. So he'll come down, visit family, stay with them, and then wrap the trucks. Kind of a two-for-one for him. I was gonna have to double the rope where we could steer you more, yeah. but it, it worked out. The day has been slow, so you want me to hold it. Okay. Yeah, the end of this month, this been, it's just been dead slow. Right. Hopefully it'll pick up here shortly. Just like anything else, it comes with spells. Yep. Yeah. No old saying, fe feast or famine. That's right. I know this, all this water probably hurt y'all. Y'all got to mulch this? No. I got to go there. I think it's a Cala Creek or something like this. Or something like that. But anyway, I'm going down 15 right there, straight across from where, um, Sumter Coast. Right. Beaver's got it damned up on this ear, so I was trying to figure out a better way to access it. But um, my trap girl stayed up in there, but I can't, I can't walk to do it with my truck. Well, you know, it that stood up better, even pulling you, it, it spun a little bit, but. Okay. I wasn't worried about that. I said you had that, but anyway, I sure appreciate it. All right, Carson. Yes, sir. Have a good one. All right, you too.
okay viewers it was a little bit tougher than i thought it was going to be but we were able to get him in there and get him maneuvered around and out and uh, no problem carson he's a he's a good customer of ours he's got a couple of videos up that uh that we went out and did for him and, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to comment like share and if you like our content and channel please subscribe and as always stay safe out there and we'll catch you on the next one